All right. What do we got, Rick? We got oh. something here. <laughs> something glowing green. That's a caterpillar. It is a caterpillar. I don't know what type. Uh, like a... It is a geometrid. Yeah? Yeah, it's a little geometrid moth. Hmm. Caterpillar. Look at him. Isn't he cute? That's <laughs> so cool. Isn't he cute? Look at him. Little inchworm. Oh. They like to hang from their little... Their little thread here, and uh, let's see if I can get them to, to, stay in your... to stay on my finger here. Look at them. Oh, isn't he cute? That's <laughs> so cool. Yeah, it's probably a Samia, uh, what are they called? I'm forgetting my Latin names. It's been two years, guys, since I've really done much mothing down here. And uh, this guy's a, the little green geometrids, the little green ones that lay flat on the sheet. I know what yeah, you're talking about. Yeah, that's him right there. So that's a large caterpillar. That's a, yeah, it's, he's probably full grown. Yeah. Very good, very good. Well, I'll put him back on his plant. Yeah, let's let him. Let him go. Back on his tamarind tree. There he goes. There you go. There he goes. Ciao, homie. I heard a bunch of commotion. <laughs> Ricky, what do you have in the net there, buddy? Dude, uh, hi. That's a big, something uh, flopping see, around there. Something huge. That's a huge witch moth. You want me to record you get it? Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, let's go in here. Woo, woo. Right there, right there, right there. Oh my God, she's huge. He, he is huge. Oh, he is. He's he, a he. Big boy, big boy. That's a big boy. Yes, he is. Well, let's see if we can get this guy. Hopefully, without damages that much. No. Yeah, I know how they are. Yep. They don't like to be touched. Uh-oh, <laughs> scary moment. Got him. Got him? Okay. Oh, it looks good. He's in great shape. Oh, my God. Oh, man. Here we go. All right. So, guys, Black Witch, Ascalafa odorata, the Black Witch. Mm -hmm. They're, Ricky, you know, um, here, let me see. So, guys, there's all kinds of legends Yep. Uh, ab around this moth. Ricky, you're from Cuba, right? Yep, yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's one. She didn't like, he, didn't, oh. he didn't like you to touch me. Oh that's my, I, a bug just flew right down my windpipe. A witch moth, oh, a witch moth got me. He sent it to you. <laughs> Dude, I think I'm seeing a butterfly. Okay, Ricky. Um, oh, look at that. That's how. Huh. Look at that. What is it? You see it? It's a butterfly. Oh, sulfur. It's a sulfur. Which one? I don't know. Yeah, it's a sulfur. Right there. I see him. He's a little beat up. Hey. Let's see. It oh, is. It is. The oh, large orange sulfur, guys. It's the large ones. Large orange sulfur. It's oh, large orange. Phoebus agarithi. It's a male. Somebody took a chunk. Yeah. Oh, he, oh yeah. Bird, so, a bird or a lizard or something like yeah. that had a field day with this guy. Somebody wanted to eat. Somebody wanted to eat him, but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and let him. Yeah, let's put it back. Let's put him back. Oh, oh. there he goes. Oh, it's gone. Well, well now he really. wants to. Now he wants to be around my light. So cool. Huh? <laughs> okay, the Ricky. Yeah. About the. About the um. Really? <laughs> there you go. There you go. There you go. Yeah, here we go. Oh, oh bro. Come, is on. It your... <laughs> it's come on, man. <laughs> Look at this. That thing's in your head. Come on. Yeah. It's gone now, I believe. Black witch. Dude, the, the black, black witch. witch. Okay. Ricky, tell me about the black witch moth, the legends from your the island of Cuba. What, what do you well, hear about in this guy? Cuba, what I believe, where people when people when they got to when they go to your house, they said that people We'll visit your house. I don't know. Oh, if that's true or not? Well, that's a nice legend yeah, compared to what not, I heard. It, compared to what you know, is the difference. So I know black witch is yeah. something. In bad. Central America, Bruja Negra. Mm -hmm. It's called the Bruja Negra black witch. Uh, the legend is in Central America that if one of these flies into your house, because a lot of Central American houses they don't have air conditioning. Of course. So they have these little openings where air passes through. And the black witch, they love hanging out and that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. So they say when one of these comes in your house, that there's going to be a death in the family. Wow. So the black witch, I don't know about a death in our family, but your family is not looking so hot. <laughs>
<laughs> no, and the it. funny thing, I was with my UV light. You know. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Those goodness. bugs. Don't that is it. not COVID, y'all. <laughs> a bug flew down my freaking throat. Um, and yeah, I was looking for caterpillars, and I saw that. Ugh. Huge thing flying. I said, like, get the net, get the net. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Okay? Well, guys, yes, yeah, so I'm okay. I'm just trying to breathe. Uh, Black Witch, guys, pretty cool moth. So cool on Moth in Moth Week that we get to show you a super cool moth like that. Uh, oh, let me show you the difference between the male and female here. Let me put this light on. Oops. Okay. The males or the females have a big band. clear band that comes down here through the middle mm -hmm. and the and the males don't. So the males are just black, but when they're fresh like this one, you see like there's a purple iridescent sheen. Mm -hmm. and this is a really nice fresh specimen. So uh, pretty cool. Mr. Witch, thanks buddy. <laughs> All right guys. All right, well, Rick, we think we see our first caterpillar I have no idea what that is. Oh, look at the witch, 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 witch. black witch moth. Get it, get it, get it, get it. <laughs> I got it. Oh, I got it. No, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I got the light for you. Okay. So cool. He got so confused with his... Uh... <laughs> yeah. Don't skip. Can't see. Watch. I think it's gone. <laughs> it's gone. Right, right, there. There, right there, right there. Got him. <laughs> Got him. Black witch. Hey. <laughs> cool moth, man. So the, he, he doesn't have really... Oh, he kind of glows a little bit. Yeah. Does the black witch glow? Oh, look at the, the abdominal segments. Oh, yeah, it does. The abdom, abdominal segments light up. Yes, they do. Cool. It does. So cool. Beautiful, man. Let's go see the caterpillar. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's definitely... We definitely got our first caterpillar up here, guys. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Um, yeah. Yep. So, here, yeah, grab the light, up. grab the light. Okay. And then what I'll do is I will bend the tree, bend the tree down. But I don't know where it is anymore. Oh, wait, find him. Find him first. Yeah, right here. A little bit more. Oh, I got it. <sighs> I think it's an L. All right. No, it's not L. Let's see. It's a pink moth, but I don't know which one. Let's see, guys. That's not poison uh, wood? It's not poison wood. Come on. What is that? Guys, I really it's don't... An it's an elo. It's probably elo. Yeah, I see the... the yeah, the, elo, the elo's got the little cyclops thing eye spot on the top. But you can see how they they just light up green. Well, an, an elo that size, it shouldn't have the horn, right? No, the, the smaller instars have the horn. That's why yeah, he still has yep. a horn. He's still he's still on a he's still got another instar to go. Oh, okay. Look at the blue butterfly that just landed on me. <laughs> Look at yeah. this. Look at this butterfly. Look at the bunch. Yep. They weren't maybe. So, the guys, um, see how they glow? They do glow. So cool. They do glow, and that was he was way up there, and we found him really really easy with the UV light. Look how he just lights up. He's got like a two tone purple and purple and green. Okay, so what do you think? We should probably let him go, huh? He's a little bit small. What do you think? I don't know. If you, you think we, we, we would, uh, I don't have this plant. The one that I have, what is it called? The, um, the Christmas plants. I forgot. Poinsettia. Poinsettia. I don't know if they switch. Hmm. Look at how cool he is. He's got the little cyclops eye on his upper yeah. thorax. So. Great ground. Okay. Down there. Okay. Down, down there. I can see, see it. Yeah, it's right there. Oh, yeah. You see? It's right there. See kind of buzzing? Yeah. What are you doing? I don't see any more. 
can hear him. Yeah, he's there. Oh, there he is. Oh, she. She. What are you? All right, then. Aloe Sphinx, guys. Female aloe. She's sitting in a big thing of her host plant. Yeah. Like this, this guy's, this poinsettia stuff. This is poinsettia? This is all native poinsettia. This is what they'd be laying eggs on. I mean, they're, they're polyphagous, which means that they'll eat a whole bunch of different things. But this plant right here is what you would expect to find an Ella Sphinx caterpillar. Yes. I mean, come on. Well, when we got here, one was laying eggs over there. One was laying eggs, yep. And this one was doing the same. Yep. For sure. Yep. She's, she's poking around, probably, probably trying to lay eggs. I would have bet. Like we're not finding a whole lot of caterpillar or caterpillars here, but I bet if we come back in August, oh yeah, it'll probably be loaded because that's just known to be the Sphinx moth month. Oh, Cassius blue flying around, oh, yeah. looking for Cassius blues at night. Yeah, I'll turn that off yeah, so I you can see. Yeah, what's to turn off that off? Yeah. See if I can find. That. Let's find us a. Caterpillar. Caterpillar, come on, man. It's gotta be. That's, that's what I'm saying. It's gotta, gotta be, be man. One. This is this is like Elo Sphinx land right here. This is like a Starbucks for humans. <laughs> Starbucks. Starbucks. Ouch! Mosquito biting. Yeah, man. Mosquitoes. They're not as bad as they can be. But they're out. Here, check this bush here, buddy. Right there. You see one? I see a bunch of stuff. Bunch of stuff? No, that's a... Oh, Look at yeah, this. yeah, yeah. Look at this on top, on top. Oh, you know what they are? No. They're, um, this is Florida Trema. This is, um, cool, guys. All right, so we're, we're going to collect some of them. these. Yeah, these are the, um, tussock moths. The tussock, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, cool. Excellent, excellent, excellent. All right, let me see. These guys jump, so we have to be careful. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. I collected those before. Oh yeah? Well, actually, All right, guys. Yeah, that one, yeah. So we have here, uh, this is Halicidota. Halicidota, I believe this is syncopes. And it would be cool to probably try and get some of those guys and do some life cycle work. Yep. You ready? You want to try and get a few? I don't want. No? No. You're good? I have them. You have them? Yeah, it's the same plant right. that I feed them and everything. It's the same one that I have. All right. All right, guys, I just wanted to show you the tussock moth caterpillar. This is Halicidota syncopes final instar. They've got this cool little, like, Indian headdress going thing going on by their head. They are super cool. Uh, we've got some earlier instar caterpillars here. You did, Ricky found something. Guys, I just wanted to show these to you. This is an Arteid moth. I'm gonna show you this life cycle here, guys, and I'm gonna dump these in. And we're gonna go over and see. We're gonna go, guys, we're gonna go see what Ricky found. Cocoon. Oh, you know what that is? No. Oh, yeah. So, okay, Ricky, show us what you found, buddy. This right here. All right. And glows. It so glows cool. in the dark. Oh. Guys, it's a glow in the dark cocoon. Cocoon or a chrysalis. A chrysalis, chrysalis. Yeah, not, not Guys, a cocoon. this is Polygonia Leo, the hammock skipper. Oh, really? I that's it. Yeah, that's bro. That's awesome. a hammock skipper. Awesome. Hammock skipper butterfly. The, even the chrysalis glow, guys. That's awesome. So black lighting is cool. You can find stuff really easy. Because that thing, show them how it lights up. Oh, my God. Just, just from, like from, uh, from you know, a mile away. From a mile away. Look at this. You can see real clear how that thing lights up green. <laughs> I thought it was like a caterpillar and then. Yeah. Like, oh, Excellent. <laughs> oh, what, what you got? I don't know. Uh, uh, butterfly. <laughs> oh, it's gone. Oh, he gone. He flew. But Cassie's blue. I went to crash my... The mosquitoes are getting yeah, mosquitoes bad. Mosquitoes are getting bad, yeah. They're getting bad. We get into this like like dense understory here. Let me show you what this looks like in here, guys. Yep. This is where we're going. Oh, look at the witch moth right in front of you. Where? 
Look at this guy. Look at this. Where, where, where? Right here. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. That's a big male, right? It is yeah, a, a male. A me, look at that guy. Wow. <laughs> I was looking for something flying. I Yeah. <laughs> Do it, man. Do your thing. I love how they you go in? They slide down, yeah? No. There it is. Oop. Black witch. Oh, it's gonna go. It's gonna go. <laughs> hold the light. Yep. Okay, Ricky thinks he sees some caterpillars here, guys. Uh, no. No? No, bro. They're just dead leaves? Dead leaves that glow in the dark. Mm -hmm. Boy, oh boy. It's not cool. Not at all. Big old gumbo limbo. Big old poison wood. So if we were going to see a uh, protambulux larva, it would be in this tree right here. Where? The one right above you. See if you see any green, glowing green stuff up there. It's a poison wood, no? Oh, no. Oh. They, you see one? Oh, no, no, no. It's a dead leaf. Yeah, the poison wood, the, the protambulux light up, man, like Christmas. Like Christmas. Yeah, they're bright. If they're out, I mean, they're really easy to find. Yeah. This light has so much power. Mm -hmm. It gets hot. People think we're crazy, Ricky. I know. They're coming out here in the middle of the night, uh, middle of the woods. I believe you. With uh, nothing but some black lights and oh, <laughs> nothing to protect ourselves but a butterfly net. <laughs> I know. I have friends that would they would not. Not they would not appreciate not this. this. No. Trust me. Mm -hmm. Not a, not a whole lot of caterpillars here, guys. Not really. Uh, we're finding a few things. We're finding some black witch moths are all over the place, which is kind of cool. We're seeing some Ello Sphinx flying around. We saw one Ello Sphinx caterpillar, but um, not a whole lot else for Moth Week. We're trying to figure out, show you guys some stuff for Moth Week. Well, Ricky, you find something? Yeah. What we got? I, it didn't really light up. Oh, that is an interesting bug right there, dude. It's a large color. Oh, yeah. What have we got here, guys? You want to use your lights? Yeah, let me it, it see. Has better, it will show better the colors. Yeah, well, let's see. Oh, I think that thing died. I don't know. Oh, yeah. What is that? I don't know what it is. So that'll make it really He's eating tamarind, which is in my yard. Oh, let's take it. Oh, oh he's coming home. Yep. He is coming home. Uh, did you? We didn't bring a Tupperware this time, did we? No, let's put it inside the net. Put it in the net? Yeah, I want to see if I can find any more. Oh, did he drop? Did he drop? What the heck? Yeah, some of those things jump. But I don't see it here. No way. No, he's not here. Where'd he go? This was the stem he was on. Yeah, he jumped. He jumped. Dude. Okay, hold on, hold on. Magic one. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I get it? All right, guys, I found him. We got him. Uh, they're eating the flowers of the tamarind bush, t t tamarind tree. So... Uh, guys, we actually found a couple of these guys. So what we're going to do is I'm going to bring them home and I'm going to raise them because I've got tamarind in my yard. And it's it's a noctuit of some kind. 
uh, I unfortunately I didn't bring a Tupperware with me on this little walk. So I'm just gonna use my net and hopefully. Yeah. All right, Loret, Ricky, what do we got here, bud? Look what we got, brother. Oh, sooky, sooky. That's Look the at the beauty. Protambulux larva, guys, on poison wood. Now the question is, how does one harvest a, because if you go snapping that stem, he's going to give a sap and cause us very extreme discomfort. I have a, I, I do have a, um, I do have a rag, which we can use. He's like second, third star? Oh, he's, he's probably beginning a final. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He's ready to go, man. Yes, yes, me, yes. Give me the, the phone. We're good, dude. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna take. I'm just gonna take guys with my rag. One little stem. Okay. Not so bad. Not so bad. Put them in my net. Have them go hang out here. Flashlight in there. Sorry. Yeah, he's in there. He's down there. Yeah, he's down there, hanging out with his uh, his, friends. his little buddies down there. So, good job, Rick. Yes, sir. Come on, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, baby. Let's go. Oh man, well, I'm glad we finally found one. Uh, we so now we've got an Elo Sphinx. We've got a Pertambulux Stragilus. Streak Sphinx, Caterpillar, and whatever these things are that we found on the Tamarind. So, good job, man. Thank you, sir. I don't know if I have poison with a around home. Oh, Brazilian pepper. Oh. Brazilian pepper. Well, <laughs> All right, guys. So, that's going to wrap it up for our moth collecting uh, for the evening. The sun is starting to come up. There's the moon. You can actually see the little crescent moon up there uh in the in the skyline the new moon is going to be in four days so uh we're going to be wrapping this up but we are able to find pertambulix carteri larva we were able to find a um elo sphinx larva we're able to find some of these um tussock moth caterpillars and we've got some mystery Noctuid moth larvae that feeding on wild tamarind that I can't wait to raise out and see what they emerge into because we're going to document those life cycles and bring them to you. Uh, guys, we, have, we still haven't collected our light traps yet, so we're going to have that video coming for you soon. You guys, we're having a great time. Moth Week, South Florida, um, having a great time. It's a little buggy. Once the sun starts to come out, the deer flies start to erupt. And the, mos the salt marsh mosquitoes down here in the Florida Keys, just, they just go crazy. So um, I'm going to put this down in my truck. We're going to start setting up, packing up our stuff. And we are going to head for um, safe grounds so we don't get eaten alive by bugs. So, guys, <laughs> give me a thumbs up. Thanks for, so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. Until next time, let's get out there and enjoy South Florida. Bye now.